Luigi's Mansion 3 looks like pure fun. I've been waiting for this one all year long, and it's finally arrived on the spookiest day of 2019. Nintendo drops this single-player epic on Halloween. What's going on, everybody? It's Ghost Robo. We're going to play a bunch of the beginning of the game, kind of like a part one. I don't know how much more we'll play. If you guys really enjoy it and want to see more of the game, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments down below. We're playing some other games right now. I know I am really excited for this one, but I want to know if you guys are excited for this one. We don't often do a lot of Nintendo stuff on this channel, so wanted to try it out with you, but the game has gotten insane reviews. Some people are saying it's the prettiest Switch game. Some people are saying it's one of the best Switch games. So we had to find out. And Luigi is taking his talents to a hotel. And that, to me, is the greatest part of all. Because it's not just a mansion with dark corridors and some ghosts. It's basically a theme park. 17 different worlds that have been compared to Mario Odyssey worlds. Obviously, it's not the same 3D exploration in that sense, but a lot of creativity, a lot of care, and a lot of character are in this one. So let's enjoy this adventure together. Wowie Zowie is right. That is one huge hotel. Polterpup is in tow. And we are ready to go. Goodness gracious, the character models are oh, yeah. so freaking nice. I wonder if Princess Peach's royal coach has, uh, has movies on the back of every seat. We've got balloons for Toad Luigi. <laughs> Mario and Peach, they're very happy to have us here, and this game is beautiful. You may not be able to rotate the camera or remap the controls, but look at this. Oh my goodness gracious. Can I have some of this food? I don't have a vacuum yet to mess with it, but Mario, Mario sure looks like he's about to mess with it. They got presents for us. The hotel menu says, welcome to the last resort, home of the most memorable vacations ever had. Sounds promising to say the least. Toad has a lot of luggage. In fact, there there are toads to take Princess Peach's luggage. It looks like she's got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 8, at least 18 bags. I see one for Mario. I don't even see a Luigi bag. 
Hello, receptionist. How's it going? Is something the matter? I hope nothing is making your stay here less than perfect. Our entire staff is devoted to providing you with the ideal vacation experience. <laughs> I like how the ghost has a mask on and Luigi's like, oh, eh. I mean, the dude's just Shakespearean. What can I say? He loves his plays. But this, oh, the game is freaking beautiful. Polterpup is getting flowers for Peach. Ooh. It's in the box, Polterpup. Alright, we can start to knock things. Because physics are here. Nintendo just doesn't do, like, story-based games in this way very often. I mean, it, and it's not the heaviest story, obviously. But the fact that there's any story is, like, really impressive, I think, for a Nintendo single player. I, I can't even remember the last one they did in this vein. Was it Luigi's Mansion? Alright. Hotel room service? Please make yourself comfortable. Perhaps you'd like to sample our selection of beverages. Nice. Ma everybody's got a freaking mask on. Everybody's got a mask. It's a little spooky. It's kind of like the Hollywood Tower Hotel, but it's the last resort. And uh, I think we should talk to Peach. What does she have to say? You got, you got any words? Are you impressed? Are you happy? Hi. This hotel is so big, Luigi. It's gorgeously decorated, too. We're so lucky to have gotten an invitation to come here. <laughs> you should always worry when it's an invitation. That, that is bound to lead to some big battle with Bowser or Boo or somebody, right? It's just, like, inevitable. All right, this dude looks creepy as heck. <laughs> Welcome, guests, to the last resort. Are you ready to check in? Let's go. Thank you. Thanks, steward. Ooh. Guests, welcome to the last resort. My name is Helen Gravely, and I'm the owner of this hotel. I'm absolutely delighted that you decided to accept my invitation. This is like Hotel Transylvania if Nintendo bought the IP. It's kind of what it reminds me of, honestly. <laughs> but with Mario characters, the Mushroom Kingdom fused. You all must be very tired. Come, allow me to show you to your room. Oh, no need to worry about your luggage. Our exceptional staff will take care of it for you. Those masks are kind of freaky. Mario and Luigi need to get better at recognizing when things are going wrong, because th this happens to them so often. Ha ha ha, you're our VIPs after all. We've prepared a first-rate experience for you. All the trappings of luxury. Shall we get going? Trappings? VIP? Last resort? Come on, Luigi. Suss it out, boy. I love that they brought the whole gang this time. They're like, dude, we need a vacation from all this nonsense. Mario's been to space. Other worlds. Freaking Isle Delfino. They've been racing. They've been playing tennis. They've been partying it up and they, they can't go online, so it's just local. They need, they need this resort. Fifth floor is where we, we find ourselves. Not the first, but the fifth. Interesting. Mario, Luigi, and Peach's rooms are over here. The Toad Boys? They're over there. I hope you enjoy your stay. I dare say you'll remember it for the rest of your lives. Ha ha ha. Do they notice we have a ghost dog with us? Uh -huh. <laughs> Bye. 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 Okay. Bye. Gotta keep things real, um, real mature here. Okay. Peach has her own room. Mario has his own room. Luigi has his own room. It's a little oh. interesting in that Mario and Luigi don't even want to share. They just are taking their time here. Oh, dude, the lighting on these objects is insane. I can't wait for the Mario animated movie. You guys know that they're making one, right? Like, that's gonna be crazy. I hope it looks like this. Like, I hope they find a way to make it super fun, not corny, and just, like, be really unique and, and interesting and, and kind of beautiful. Poppy! Charles Martinet. Dropping dimes already. Can we... I thought, I thought maybe we could activate the bathtub, but I think it's just for Puppy. Oh. Luigi can't take up... That's a gigantic toilet for Luigi. How is he gonna get up there? Feeling like a baby boy all of a sudden. Goodness gracious, that's gonna be awkward. All right, I feel like where they want us to go is the big wardrobe, right? There's like birthday hats, comfy bed, some drawers, and this creepy wardrobe with an emoji on it. <laughs> Nothing in the drawers. All right, Polter Pup, what do you think, man? It's like obviously stuff that we can eventually poltergeist out of here, but for now... Oh, what? 
Ooh, look, is the door vanishing or what? I feel like the character models have gotten better even since Odyssey. I mean, it's been two years, right? Hello? It's so bright and sunny. You know, it's not like a rainy day. It's not like a catastrophe outside. Can we, like, hop in bed with Polterpot, maybe? Buddy. Time to rest? Yeah, let's, uh, let's take a nap here. Yeah. Luigi's little suitcase. What's he got? A few hats? Maybe an apple? I feel like Luigi loves apples. Oh, a flashlight. <laughs> a flashlight, a little journal, and another of his outfits. That's what we got. Luigi packs light. He's the ideal, ideal travel companion. What we reading tonight? Luigi's Mansion 2? Mario Galaxy? Okay, he's just out. Out like a light. 13 hours on the flight to get to the last resort. And more than 13 floors that we're about to dig through. What happens once the sun goes down? <laughs> Peach is freaking. Okay, okay. Hello? Things have gotten real goofy all of a sudden. Okay, the balloons. Are, okay, I got chills, man. This is this is exactly what you don't want on Halloween. Okay. Rats. Oh, dude. Hello. A little bit of water. The floors are so misty. Everything's muggy. Oh, oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Okay, now we can exit. I don't think this is going to be good at all. What do you see? Okay. Purple glow. All the luggage is waiting outside. Mario. <laughs> Goodness gracious, this game is beautiful, isn't it, guys? Gargoyles. The halls got a whole lot scarier, didn't they? Room service has been to Mario's room. Oh, God. Is that a Black Widow? Oh, oh my. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. <gasps> Mario? 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 He had a lot of pizza. But nobody here. Not good. A lot of dust in these rooms. Housekeeping is not doing their job. There's some creepy green drinks on the table. He's got pizza plenty. What about the princess's room? Huh. 501. Oh, Peach. Peach with all of your bags. What did you possibly bring? I hope she brought a switch light. A lot of perfume. Oh, can we go outside? No, but there's a bunch of ravens out there. Hi, Raven. Ooh. Okay. Little hyenas. All sorts of spooks. Looks like freaking Lion King, Green Goblin, and Vampire. Um. This doesn't look so good. Huh. There's skulls on the desk. Uh oh. A haunted elevator. Never a good sign. Someone's arrived though. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Dude, this is this is scarier than I expected. It's you. Well, 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 if it isn't my most esteemed VIP. I was just on my way to see you. Is your room living up to your expectations? Doesn't it scream good taste? Uh, oh, I can barely contain myself. You have no idea how much I wanted to see you accept my invitation. Why is that? I'm sure you're wondering. <laughs> you see? There is someone I truly adore. He's the inspiration for some of my greatest ideas. Like inviting you here. I'm such a huge fan of his. That's why it's so wonderful that I get to introduce him Luigi. to you. That's right, Luigi. I hope you're ready. 
Who are we saying hi to? <gasps> King Boo, of course! He's back. Mwahaha, <laughs> surprise Luigi, it's a me, King Boo. That old coot had me locked up tight in his lab. But guess what? I got out. The hotel owner here was just dying to meet me, so she busted me out. Pretty lucky, huh? Anyway, I didn't think you'd actually show up here. I was ready though, just in case. In fact, my vengeance is nearly complete. What do I mean by vengeance? Glad you asked. I'm trapping you and everyone in your little vacation party in frames! Aw, there, there, Luigi. It'll all be over soon. It's time for a family reunion! Oh, yeah! Great. Great, everyone's back in the picture palace. Oh, no! <sighs> Take that! Oh, and there's one more frame, of course. I saved it especially for you. <laughs> Stay right there and put on your best terrified face, Luigi. This is game over. Well, guys, hope you enjoyed the Luigi's Mansion 3 campaign. It's over now, 16 minutes in. Okay. You gotta get out of here. King Boo is crushing us. Oh my goodness gracious, look at that mean mug. Dude, that is one angry face. Get out of there, Luigi! Goodness gracious! The ghosts are stealing the doors. We got nowhere to go. Into the, the trash chute? Dude, I lost my keys down one of these ones. But a trash shoot is better than a picture frame. Make like Luke. Let's hit that compactor. Oh. Goodness gracious. Title screen? I mean, you had to wait for the hotel to hit its true look before we could get the title screen. And now the last resort has turned from gold to ghoul. This ain't no vacation. This is a nightmare, and we're ready to dive fully in. Egad, you better be down in the trash room. You better pick us out. I need to be safe, I, and I need I need some sort of device to start sucking things up, dude. These polter pup follows down here. <laughs> Ghost slobber is the stickiest. Oh, puppy. Yeah. Where are we? It's not as dingy as I expected. It's still a. I guess it's more of a laundry room than a trash room. It's kind of like an escape room. What's that? Hey, what's that? Something green and... Oh, it's a gem. Polterpup, don't you dare do that to me, my dude. We gotta get... our vacuum. Something wicked this way comes. It looks like... That's not just an ordinary horse. That's some sort of spooky spook. It's a little hard to, like... You know, there's been a lot of talk about the controls because you... You move the light switch, but you're all, you move Luigi, and it turns him and moves it, so it's hard to, like, keep it, like, pinpointed in one spot. Like, I mean, it, I guess you have to, like, just let go of the stick. And that's a little finicky. We're gonna have to figure it out as we go. Egan, is this your room? Uh -oh. Older pup. Oh, look, 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 look. This looks like a little, little rat hole. Maybe a space for a future friend of ours. So many mice. Older pup, what are you doing? Oh. <gasps> well, would you look at that? How convenient. You got it. It almost feels like a Pixar movie. Obviously, Luigi doesn't speak, but it's got kind of like the same like cute tunes and like spooky nature and just fun that you'd expect from something out of the Bugs Life studio. And yes, I'm using Bugs Life, not Toy Story. Okay, what do you... Oh. We can flash Polterpup. He's teaching us some of his moves. Flash the puppy. 
with the light. Lock him in space. Lock him in sight. Suck him up. Okay. I love the tutorials with the, the dog. What a what a helpful little little ham. All right. Suck, blow, flash, and oh yeah, the explosive shot. Some new moves this time around. Luigi's all grown up. Comfortable with what you learned? Yes, sir. Pup says goodbye, and now it's our chance to really dive in. We can mess with everything here, suck it all up. I'm gonna try not to be like a hundred percenter. It's just a little tempting because, like, I don't know. It's so fun to just to mess with stuff, blow it around, suck it up, look for coins. You know, there's just there's something fun about oh about just messing with all the little physics puzzles and things they put in the game. You know, you don't have to. Apparently the currency is only for extra lives and hints, which they say you don't need really too much of in the game. But it's still like a, a very neat way to interact with the world. Do like this this spin dance as we go. Let's see, can we pull this off? Gotta be able to, right? Unveil that car. Ooh, hello. Can we flash the car? <gasps> Ooh, in comes a gem. Thank you very much. Oh, there's different gems per level. Okay, this is a cool collectible then. So that's worth hunting down. I don't know if there's any reward for it, but I like hunting down stuff like that. Can we suck the dice up? I like the little explosive blast. And I like that it's not limited. I think you can just kind of do that over and over. Dirt patches lead to goodies. Huh, what's this? Can we hit that? Oh. Oh no, that ain't gonna work. Shoot, I was hoping we get to, it's like dang, they're gonna let us walk like into the screen like that? Hey, listen up, rap boy. Trying to hurt my health. Money on the shelves. Dude, that's a lot, that's a lot of dollars. Luigi is gonna rack it up. He's gonna be able to get so many amiibo by the time this is all said and done. There's like an electric Whoa. sign here. Um. No, oh, kick it open. That's all we got to do. Nice and easy. All right, how do we get in here? It's showing like electricity, so I think we probably need some, some sort of future. I don't know. Huh? Interesting. You can see like. Now, there's got to be some way to open this door, huh? Okay. We'll head out first. That's the garage room. I quickly want to return back to the laundry room because I know there was a gem hidden in the washing machine. Not sure if we... I'm guessing green lights mean you shock them open? No? Huh. I thought that's what green lights mean. Alright, grab the gold bar. Off the shelf, thank you very much. And now we can hunt truly. Ooh, I bet it's this. Uh oh. Yeah, overload the vents. Look at all that cash we're grabbing. I love that this uh, vacuum has like infinite suck power. Doesn't like ever run out. Not even really plugged in. Just got a very ghostly power source, I guess. It's so cool to watch like the dollar bills fly off the shelves, huh? Okay. How do you think we mess with these machines? I thought it might be like flashing it, but I guess not. The green light I thought might mean you, know, you gotta flash it. Huh. I guess not. There's always the potential that we need a different power or something. As I promised, I'm gonna try not to get too stuck on certain situations. Let's see, what if we reverse it the other direction? Hey, can we unplug them? No. That'd be pretty fun. More money on the on the shelf. Thank you kindly. All right. 
Let's get on with it. We can come back for that gem later if we need to. We gotta get we gotta get the EGAD. Is that donut? Did Luigi just take a donut off the floor? Oh. Coins in the ceiling? Gold bricks on the ceiling? Dude, this resort is loaded. Hey, aim up. There we go. Might as well get a lot of goodies now. So I'm guessing we're gonna have to run later. Oh, what's this? Flash flash into Luigi's lab or Egad's lab? Thank you. Professor. Cabo cabo. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. Ah. Hello. Hello. Got a vending machine? Dude, I need some gluten-free pretzels and stat. No, 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 I wanted, I wanted food, not money. Oh my god. Somebody has been buying a lot of snacks at this vending machine. That's a lot. That's a lot there, man. Oh. Alright, we're gonna do a little spring cleaning here for Egan, I guess, right? We owe it to him. Open up and you will find a freaking ton of treasure that someone has left behind. This game is so ripe for rhymes. <laughs> it's hard to contain myself. Alright. Already got a thousand big ones. More is obviously coming in quick. Um, hello? Oh, there we go. Busting it loose. Alright, we don't need every bit of currency. You're probably gonna get a lot throughout the levels, so let's head out of here. Oh. For a second I thought- Oh, wait, 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 do you see it? There's a gem. There's a gem. Okay, real quick, real quick. It's so tempting. How, do, how does one get that? Huh. Hello? Oh. oh. I thought maybe it would knock the gem down. It didn't. Huh. You see it though, right? Oh, it looks like there's another path through, like maybe a hidden hidden entry at some point. Okay, we're a floor up. There's a gem here. Dude, there's gems just everywhere. They're tempting us and teasing us with every which way. Oh, we made it back to the lobby. <gasps> Great. Mario, gone. Luigi, gone. Peach, gone. Toad, gone. Well, you're right about three of those. I wish he'd call out Todd's name. Todd. Princess. <laughs> oh no. Ghosts. And they're gunning to lock us in. Oh no, our first ghost arena. Okay, goodness gracious sakes alive. Okay, he's not even there. Let's shock him first. Got you. And then we get that suck action going on. Slam and slam and slam and slam. Beautiful. Busted you up. Luigi is sweating, but there's no time because here comes another one of these spooksters. He's calling in reinforcements. All right, come to Papa. I'm your ghost daddy. There we go. All right, all right. So the whole plan here is just to get him in the vacuum and then slam him around. Got him before he was able to get that big fist on us. All right, one, two, three, the four slams finishes the fight, erases the gates, and saves the night at least for now. Okay. Uh oh. Hello. Who's, the, who's there? Who could it possibly be? Great, King Boo. King Boo calling us like the jerk that he is. Eat the curtains. I'm hu I'm hungry, dude. I've got uh, fiber. Fiber can go a long way. There we go. Suck all the fiber down, including the couch cushions. I'm just gonna envision that Luigi is ingesting everything that goes in this vacuum. Oh, with the pumpkins. I got a pumpkin. Can I shoot it? Oh. 
<laughs> it actually explodes. That's kind of neat. Oh, we can aim it. Can I have that gem? No? All right. Can I hit... Oh. Polterpup. What's up, dude? Head up to the balcony? Okay, well, I was just trying to... Look at Luigi, he's like shaking his hands, he's so nervous, look at him. Oh. Okay. I don't think I can get under here just yet. Oh, maybe I can, sweet. What is this gold thing, it's a key? Get the key. Right, just grab it, dude, there you go. You got the gold key. Perfect. And there's a something other to hit here. Can we press it? Flash the light. Oh, yes. Grab the gem. We got the purple. Spin it on your finger. Like you are a Toon Squad star. Grab the rubber ducky. Don't want that getting into the wrong hands. Gonna need it for bath time later. Because I'm, I'm planning the best jacuzzi party out at the, the freaking resort pool. Once all is said and done. Alright, let's head up. Polter pop. Well, there's this side over here. Any oh, that's where we came from. Okay, cool. The elevator and whatnot. Look at Luigi's <laughs> animations running up the stairs. So cool. Polter pop. It's a big door. Hmm. Uh -huh. We do have a golden key. Guess this is where it comes in handy. In we go. Poor boy is so freaked out. I would be too. Like, imagine exploring a giant hotel all by yourself. Egad's in a portrait too? No way. Not my dude. Not my dude, Egad. You can do Mario dirty. You can do Peach dirty. It's happened so many times before, but really, you're gonna mess with our grandpa? The glorious Egad? E, I'm so sorry. All right, Polterpup says we gotta go this way. To save the day. All right, I'm following you, my dude. Think he's in here? Oh, it's... I need another key. All right, dude. There are so many rooms already. A dressing room, and there's one of the masks. Yeah, Luigi. Now you're feeling silly. Oh, look at that. There's a a button of sorts on the wall. Time to use a little bit of a mirror psychology. Oh, can we jump in there? There's the key, we got it, okay. Quick little mirror puzzle. Grab the key, and now hopefully we can get Gad out of his predicament. Oh, it's a bag of cash. My controller has a low battery. No, we're gonna have to stop soon. Shoot. I'm playing the pro controller docked here, by the way. No, look, they're putting up Luigi Wanted posters. Hey, ghost boy. Get over it. It ain't happening. I'm not going in that frame. I'm not going with King Boo. I'm not going with you. All right, get him real quick. Pull against their tail. Ah, too bad you can't get multiple. Oh, you can get multiple ghosts in the slam radius. That's so cool. I like that a lot. Where are you at? Where are you at? Got my flashlight charged up. There, he's right behind us. Gotcha. He was winding up for a punch. Not gonna let that happen. There we go. And get done for. All right. Whew. Oh yes. Oh yes. Kick it open. Grab the goodies. Can we get these posters out of here, please? All right. Is this is a map. Oh. 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 This is where you are. There's the the powder room, the bathrooms, the kitchen, the chef's chamber. I don't know what that one is. The dancing hall. We got a lot of, lot of, lot of things going on here. Uh, I want to suck all the Luigi pictures off the wall. I don't want anyone coming for me anymore. That ain't happening. Not gonna let it happen. Okay. Hmm. Mm. Huh? Luigi's like, which way, USA? In we go. There's money in a portrait. How did how did King Boo lock money up? Walter Pup trying to spook us there. I don't think he means to, but... Rats. Always with the mice. Luigi and mice don't have a very good history. Okay, 
How do we get the money out? Can we get this sucked up? Doesn't seem to want to. Okay, let's open the safe. What's that? Looks like an attachment? Yeah, buddy. Dude, the flashlight is modular. Something straight out of Stranger Things. Now we've got the, the power to purge portraits, it looks like. Okay, Polterpup. If we hold X, we unleash a beam of... I don't know, what would you call this energy? Iridescent energy? And yeah, out pops whatever was locked in the portrait. That's gonna come in huge help. We can go save Egad. How oh, awesome. Alright, oh goodness. Oh, the, pop the piggy bank. There we go. Popping the piglies. Grabbing. Oh, there's a golden spider. Get him, get him, get him. How do I. Come here, golden spider. Hey. Hey. Got him. Golden spider turned into a little bit of extra cash. Even the boxes. It's crazy that they make everything interactive. Isn't that just so cool? Oh no, it's Jan's candles! Uh, how will we ever open Shulala now? I guess we will not. Wow! Wow! Pull some stuff off the top shelf. Now can we open this? Oh no, but there is a hidden chest in the back of the room. It pays to explore. Again, maybe you can't buy the coolest stuff with the, the currency, but it's kind of fun just to collect it for the sake of collecting it. Gameplay for gameplay's sake, thanks for the goodies. And, and they're putting another freaking Luigi poster on the wall. Seriously, my dude? Drop that act. Drop all that stuff, come on! Can we get this whole thing off the wall? Guess not. Can we, if I... Nah, those aren't those aren't magic paintings, so it's not gonna work exactly as we like. Egad is ready to be saved. Oh my goodness, gracious! We can save the dude and win the day, and uh, we'll have to pause here. What do you guys think? I, I don't know. Uh, I I'm curious if you guys enjoy or not. But this is the first and only part right now of Luigi's Mansion 3. If there's a, a huge uh, sense of, of wanting more and support then then we can continue but for now the game seems incredible i am loving it it's beautiful it's brilliant it's the story-based switch game i've wanted all year luigi is a, a true leading hero he he has deserved his own game he had his own game and now he's back in the spotlight quite literally or i guess he's not in the spotlight he's aiming the spotlight but i'm gonna aim it back at him and say that this one is going to be one of the greats of 2019. I cannot wait to see where it goes from here. We're just at the start. We're just in the hotel lobby. The crazy floors haven't even begun, so it's bound to get even better. Big thanks to all of you for watching. Thanks so much for being here. I appreciate you a lot. Hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Let me know your take in the comments down below, and until next time, everybody, thanks again for watching. Have a fantastic day. Drink some hot chocolate, and we'll see you all later.